Okay, so between recordings I actually got an email. Uh, oh, okay, that's because I just downloaded the DLC, so that is fine, we will come to that later. Mysterious letter. Okay, that's fine. Um, first up, what you want to do is, uh, so, save first. This is crucial, because otherwise you have to go back to your last save. And this does not have autosave. Uh, talk to Jackass. Alright, we got the mackerel. We need to go items. Caught fish, I believe. And eat the mackerel. Now this gives us ending K. Uh, Ajiwukuta? Is that really the, the name of this? Having consumed the mackerel, it didn't take long for the android's bodily fluids to congeal. That's a new word. Uh, muscle rigidity and paralysis, paralysis? paralysis soon followed. Wow, I really need to learn how to read. Uh, it was good though. The android thought at consciousness fa- oh fuck, uh, ooh, sorry language, I'm gonna <laughs> stop swearing and stop reading, we're just gonna get on with the game. Aji Wakuta, so apparently that is a thing. I'm guessing Kuta's like fish or something like that. I'm trying to keep my swearing to a minimal, even though a lot of the games that I'm going to be playing uh, in future have swearing in them and <laughs> nudity and and all that kind of crap. So I guess this really is R18, but nonetheless, they can swear I shouldn't really. Okay, so we have ending K. Carrying on. That's the first ending we've actually had for a while. Um. May as well go grab the fish from Jackass, just don't eat it this time. Obviously. I mean, I'm pretty sure that would go without saying. Uh, where are we going to next? So, after we go at the fish, we'll go to Pascal. Mm, oh, yes, sweet. Okay. So, to the fish. Alright, next we're going to go to Pascal. That was a yes. Uh, so from now on through the walkthrough we're probably going to see like little uh, side missions uh, for the mysterious letter that I just received. I haven't actually played the DLC yet, but um, pretty sure it'll be alright. I'll probably do a walkthrough for that with the end of this game. Uh, but for the moment I'm going to ignore it until we get to like chapter select and stuff like that. Pretty sure you can't actually access it until you're a higher level anyways. Look at all them side quests on the map. Get on the ladder. Um, oh, we need... Just talk to her about all uh, him yes, about all the subjects. Pascal, I yes, went through this whole game Forest. thinking yes, Pascal was a girl. Where is it? Did not realize he's a dude. Is that a chest I can open? It is a chest I can open. Totally missed that. Um, all right. So anyway, that was I think talking about the Forest Kingdom and how there's you know a settlement out there, yada yada. Uh. Should I buy some of this? No, you know what, I think I'm working to save up 50,000 for uh, the Wandering Couple missions. So, I mean, spending money at this point in time is pretty... It's pointless because, I mean, you get bugger all of it until the next profile, I guess. Say, 2B. What? When do you think you'll be willing to call me 9s? 9S works just fine. Well, yeah, but... Okay, so we're gonna uh, carry on towards Man, the, the cave. This job can be pretty rough sometimes, huh? We don't get to choose our assignments. And you should work on keeping your opinions in check. 
Yorha aren't allowed to be emotional, remember? I think some of us are better at that than others. Um. Yes, here we go. Operator 60 to 2B. Come in, 2B. 2B here. The monitoring signal from the new access point has gone silent. I'm sending you the positional data. Please investigate the site as soon as possible. Understood. Alright, so we just want to look down here and go for these machines. We've got company. Looks like machines. Alert. Jamming signals detected from enemy units. Yeah? That's not good. Is that it? Alright, pick up all the items. Just FYI, the heavy breathing that the microphone's probably picking up for once isn't me, it's my dog. As I say almost every episode. And I've said. Enemy machine life forms eliminated. Access point returned to functioning status. Bunker to 2B. The signal from the access point just came back online. Good job. I have some information about that, Commander. Go on. The access point went offline because machine life forms were jamming it. Which means they know that facility is one of our network terminals. Yeah, but that's not all. While they knew it was connected to our network, they didn't try to destroy it. It's almost like they were trying to lay a trap. Damn. They're getting smarter by the day. Thank you. I'll be sure to share this with the Council of Humanity on the moon. Understood. Cool. Ah, I'm really leveled up even better. Um, uh, I'm just killing these things for the hell of it. You don't need to. It's all about that experience. Uh, so next we're going to head towards another access point. Ah, oh, I thought I killed you. Did I just kill you? Maybe there's three of them. I don't know. Life is a mystery. Um, okay, so yeah, to carry on that, um, get up the thingy, thank you. Um, to carry on the part of the quest that we just did, we need to unblock a few access points. Now, the game doesn't actually tell you this, so uh, just be wary of that. That will be your best shortcut ever up here, just saying. Uh, remember for future. So, I think the access point we need to go to is this one. Uh, I believe it's also called the City Ruin Center. Yes. No, nothing? Okay, fine. Maybe they're just hanging around. I'm pretty sure this isn't the access point we need to go to. Ah, oh, then again, there's some machines hanging around it. We got mail. Well, it's not, but... I read you, Operator. Go ahead. It looks like the transporter we installed in the city ruins has gone offline. Our surface activity is going to be severely limited until we get it fixed. Can you head over there and get it working again when you have a sec? We'll do. Thanks, Tubi. Sending the details now. Alright, let's check that one. <clears throat> yep, okay, so... Okay, so I was right, it is that one that we just went to, Report. but it seems... Notification received from access point. It's up. What? Analysis. 
malfunctioning transporters can result in serious limitations to data uploading and other vital mission activities. Recommend repairing transporter as quickly as possible. Understood. Ah, the sweet snoring sounds of a pug dog. Alright, it seems I was a little bit, um, what do you call it, quick fingered with that, I guess. Alright, so we killed everything around there, and believe it or not, boars and mooses, mo I'm just going to say mooses, um, any sort of animal like that, we've got a beast hide if you can see in the corner, uh, that's pretty crucial towards like, you know, getting um, upgrades on your weapons, and I think we even need them for quests, so kill as many of those as possible from this point out, I guess. So check the access I don't point. See any damage. Analysis. Transporter is now operational. This is Yorha Unit 2B. Connect me to Bunker Operator 60. Oh, hello, 2B. Operator 60 here. The transporter was being jammed by machine life forms. It should be working now. Looks green on my end, 2B. Nice work. I'll let command know right away. I'll also be sending over a little reward for all your hard work. Roger. You know, 2B, I'm a little jealous. Don't get me wrong, I know all this fighting isn't easy for you, but you get to see all these new and amazing things out there. It just... it might be nice to visit the surface sometime, you know? That's all. I see. Uh, right. A apologies for the unnecessary chatter. Anyway, Operator 60 out. Alright, so go check the mail. Also, uh, this should get us a quest with Operator 60. Um, which also gains us probably my favourite weapon in the game. Not sure if it's the best, but definitely my favourite. Uh, so we may as well transport ourselves to the desert oil field. So terminal repair is complete. Uh, I believe it said something about. Yep, there we go. Thanks for your help the other day, blah 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 blah. Pod? Understood. I didn't say anything yet. The conversation between Operator 60 and Unit 2B has been analyzed. Hypothesis. Unit 2B wishes to send Operator 60 a gift from the surface so that she might be able to experience it in some fashion. That's right. Proposal. The gift should be a photograph of a rare flower. You think? Analysis of historical data indicates that human females enjoyed viewing the reproductive organs of flowering plants. If Unit 2B can procure appropriate image data, it could be uploaded to the bunker. Proposal. Unit 2B should obtain an image of the plant known as the Desert Rose. All right. All right, so now that all the chat is out of the way, come over here. And we have a desert rose somewhere around here. Now I don't believe it's this item here. Uh, it's over there by the rock. Pod, take a photograph of the desert rose and send it to Operator 60. Affirmative. Image data transfer complete. To be here. Go ahead. Thank you so much for the picture. So this is a desert rose, huh? It seems almost mystical. There must just be a fountain. Oh, wrong nature button. Down there, huh? Some, yes. I've seen lilies, cherry blossoms, daffodils, and even lunar tears. I'll try to send more if I can. Oh, to be. 
I'm going to treasure this forever. Oh, and I'm going to send you a proper thank you mail later, so keep an eye out for it. Bye! Uh, Wait, what is that? Object. Complete. Oil sardine, okay. Um, anyways, we do eventually need to catch 20 fish, not for any mission, but it's for a trophy. Uh, inbox. We obtained the uh, the Type 40 sword, which is exactly what I wanted, so we may as well transfer it back to the resistance camp. Upgrade that a little bit. What have I got to do next? Okay. So we'll go get the third pod. Uh, this is actually out of the way and it's optional. You can wait until you come back to this area or otherwise, but um, well, it's a third pod. We may as well get it now. Now that the floor has opened up. <clears throat> Alright, so this way. Level it up to level 2. And we need black pills, so we'll get some of that while we're getting the third pod. Uh, don't worry about that notification. We haven't got all the photographs just yet anyways. Um, so for the third pod we need to go to the flooded city and the flooded city is actually where we get pure water and black pearls which pure pure water, couldn't even get that out pure water is uh, for your pod upgrades and you need to manually collect it you can't buy it from anywhere which is a bit of an a-hole but um, never mind so following so if you see that image follow this river out jump off the waterfall and there should be an open pipe right there my god there is a storm outside and it is just coming down I'm nice and warm in my house obviously I wouldn't be playing this outside that would be weird uh, there's a chest. How are we for time? We've still got 10 minutes. I love how she slides down in the water, but at the same time I wish they wouldn't put obstacles in the way. So it could be a continuous slide. Chest! So, pure water. Okay, so we can get that from this particular location. Otherwise, I mean, I'll go through this in a future sort of way, I guess, when we're trying to access that. More pure water, that's awesome. I think you need about 20 in total, maybe 30. But it's just going to be helpful getting that. Um, kill these dudes. Alright, map information unlocked. And coming along. Golden ore. So this area you can also farm uh, black pearls, which are just upgrading materials. You don't need a hell of a lot, but you will come to points where you're like, oh crap, I need to grind for those. Uh, Alright, and coming over we have the wandering couple. I don't think I have 50,000. That's alright. I'll fit it. We'll come back when we have it. So we've got silver ore coming around here. Have a chest. I'm pretty sure these are black pearls. They are. They're too awesome. So that'll get us our upgrade on our type 40 sword. Um, and we do want a level 3 weapon at some stage here. So that's exactly what we're going to go for. Now this area you don't really need to explore vastly, but um, I will grab, pick up one more weapon. Uh, in fact, no I won't, sorry, I'll leave that for a bit later. I'm getting far too much ahead of myself. I know it's only saved grab pod and black pearls, so that's what I'm going to do. 
otherwise I will confuse the notes. Uh, coming over here, we want to go... You can pretty much go anywhere around here. I always just go to this corner bit and hold circle for fish. Commencing. Now this could take a while, but otherwise this is exactly just how you get your pod. Okay, well that was accidental. I got I it on the first pod. try. Hypothesis. The owner pod. Cool. So Activation there you go. You get your third pod. Uh, that can take anywhere from... Oh, okay. We also got a tro trophy uh, called Pod Hunter. Awesome. Um, that can take anywhere from like one try, obviously. Lucky. Um, to like 10 to 20. Like, But definitely keep fishing around that area. Um, and you will get it. So now we have three pods, we can actually charge up our attack two with three pods instead of two, which is awesome. Anywho, going back to the resistance camp, and we will upgrade our weapon. Uh, what is next? So, third pod, get some black pearls, go, go back, upgrade, work on getting 50k. Go speak with Angles, 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 whatever his name is. Uh. All right, sweet. Basic idea of what we're doing. Uh, where are we going? This way. Alright, so we can't go to level 4 um, until we meet a particular NPC, but that is fine. I also want to see if I can... No, I can't. What do we need for that? Titanium alloy warp wire. And we have bugger all for that. Okay, we'll get those. Um... I could have actually sold a fair bit with that guy, that's fine. So, sell, from what I've noticed, we don't use our fish at all for anything. Sometimes a broken firearm or a battery. Uh, machine cores are also handy. I've got eight. I'll sell four. There we go, so that's our 50,000. Um, in fact, we've already got all of our storage maxed out. Well, that is fine then. I'll grab uh, two of these. What two do I want? Any two. I never really use them anyway. We'll grab that. So we've got our 50k. Uh, those machine cores are probably your best point of sale when it comes to getting money. Uh, what are we doing again? Talking to Engel, Engels, Engels, whatever his name is. And changing our weapon. So, 420 to 504, whereas this is 476 to 504. So, definitely a good base attack. And... Can't do up our lance at the moment, can we? I think we're probably better off keeping... Beast Lord. Yeah. Alright, we'll stay at that. <clears throat> Anywho. Uh, also, once you upgrade them to the max level, you do get certain uh, little perks. They're not great, but little perks with uh, your weapons. <clears throat> There's um, one called the Engine Blade, and that makes you, like, phase, I guess. It, I feel like it makes you faster. Not by much. 
So, talk to Ang Angles, Angles, whatever his name is. Oh, there's enemies, aren't there? There is. Go away. Is there more? Oh, you're still alive. He is tired and must rest. That is fine. And after talking to him, we need to go carry on. Alright, I might go to the uh, the place with the thing around the corner. That makes no sense. Uh, <laughs> go to the city near tower, I believe. Now, next episode we are going to be carrying on finally going to the forest. Wow, we actually did bugger all in this episode. That's fine. <laughs>